this is Elle and this is my progress update for day 2 of the Catch Up Readathon. So I decided to start off the day by finishing the book that I started yesterday and that is Molly and Me by John Grogan. Um, this is a, uh, uh, what's it called? A memoir? Sort of, almost. Uh, it's about a, it's this author and the life he has led with his dog, uh, which proved to be a very unruly dog, but also very loving and funny and stuff. And this book was quite hilarious and quite heartwarming and it really succeeded in what it wanted to be and stuff. So I ended up really liking it, giving it 4 out of 5 stars. I felt like I couldn't really give it 5. I, I'm not sure why. Um, but yeah, I mean like, if you want to feel happy then I recommend this book. After finishing that book, I decided to go on with the challenge for day two, and that is to read a book that you have been gifted. And I was going to read Metro 2033, um, which I was uh, given by my boyfriend for my birthday earlier this year. Um, but the thing is, I picked it up and I realized that it's over 450 pages and the text is pretty small. So even though I really do want to read it, and I kind of want to read it soon because it sounds really interesting, I felt like it was a little bit too long right now. So instead I decided to read Ren, The Forgotten Rooms, and that is like the best translation I can come up with, because this is a Swedish sci-fi trilogy, this is the first book. Um, and it does not have an English release, and seeing as it is a few years old, it probably won't have, so, um, yeah. But this is sci-fi, and, um, I got it as a prize for winning a short story contest, uh, how long was it ago? Uh, it was four years ago now, yeah, and I decided to read it because it's like middle grade, uh, book so the font is quite big and it's just below 300 pages so I feel like it was very overcomable and stuff. Uh, then again I didn't get much time for reading this day. I had planned sitting at home and reading all day but I got a text from one of my friends who asked if I wanted to come and uh, just yeah talk and stuff. So I left home at half past two and I didn't get back until half past nine, so quite a few hours missing there, but yeah. Anyway, I managed to read 154 pages of this before midnight, and this book was really good. This book was just really good. Like, I've been having this trilogy on my shelf for years, and I've even been thinking about giving it away because I just was not that interested. But now I started reading it and it's really good. Like, ha, huh, who knew? Um, anyway, so Molly and Me is 317 pages and I read 154 pages from Ren. So that makes my total page count for these two days 471 pages. And I'm quite happy with that actually considering that I haven't gotten that much time to read at all. Um, but yeah, I will probably finish Ren before going to sleep, because as I said, it's really good. I want to finish it. Um, and I will talk to you more tomorrow.